Okay, what's an Indian? Mama, Yolo. Amanda, what's an Indian? Yolo. Yay! I hope so. La baby blackout. Why you cross over? One, two, three. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hey, take two. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and today I'm so excited this is my first video for 2024 happy new year people I hope your 2024 is going well I pray that it will be your best year yet many blessings to you and your family and I kid you not every time I film not even noon yet it's like 11 13 but no joyo in a week a week it's here here and thank you for crossing over with me last year 2023 and i remember the date 28th December 2023 and I'm pretty sure it was on a Thursday. It was the day I faced my greatest fear for 2023. Guys, my greatest fear for 2023 was to wear a swimsuit in public. I had missed swimming. I did not want to wear a swimsuit in public. Just thinking about it, I was just getting stressed. I was getting stressed and I knew I had to overcome that fear. And let me tell you how that fear came about. After losing so much weight, guys, I was not comfortable wearing a swimsuit in public. I felt like I looked like a walking skeleton. That's what I That's what I felt like. I was like, oh my God. Everyone will be like, she's a walking skeleton. And I was so self-conscious. But I knew I had to, to overcome that fear. And guys, if you're fearful about something, let me tell you, there is no magic pill you can take. If there was, I would have taken it. There is no magic pill. <laughs> To overcome fear but to do that thing that you need to do exposure therapy that is it <laughs> exposure therapy you just have to expose yourself pole pole to that fear and that's exactly what i did but let me tell you what helped asking someone else to do it with me that really really made a difference <sighs> what helped me was bringing my mom and my bro along and they showed up let me tell you if you want to do something uh, you're afraid of doing get yourself a support system get yourself someone who will do that thing with you and i kid you not your fear will be like 50 percent less they didn't even know my internal struggles by the way. These guys, they didn't even know what I was struggling with because I didn't tell them. 
but the fact that they were there and they were having fun and I realized by the way everyone has their own internal struggles everyone I remember when we were swimming and then my brother was like Amanda do you think my chest is big enough and he was comparing himself his own body to some other guys and I was like, oh my God, you mean we are all going through the same thing here? We are all going through body insecurities. Internally, I was going through body insecurities. Kumbe internally, my bro was going through body insecurities. And I'm sure most people were there because they were wearing swimsuits. They were going through some form of body insecurity. But we all don't know. We think that we are going through it alone, which is not true that statement is never true ever ever when you believe in asema there's nothing new under the sun people people have gone through these problems people are going through these problems and people will always go through these problems so uh, what did i write the minute i was in the water doing my own thing having fun the fear dissipated and I realized how the mind can amplify fear. But once you actually go do the thing you need to do, you realize it wasn't even such a big deal to begin with. My mind was just being dramatic and even when I was editing this video and I kept staring at myself on the screen, I found a new appreciation for my body. It has been through a lot of changes in the past two years and imagine it's still here helping me experience beautiful moments with those I love. So yeah guys, be kind to yourself, be kind to your own body. If you think you have any body insecurities, skia, skia. Be kind to yourself, be kind to your own body. <sighs> At least that's what I learned. In 20, coming 2024, I will be kinder and more compassionate to my body. Yeah, that is what I will do. But I am so happy I conquered that fear. See at Imenda Kabisa, but it was the first step. And the next step, I will be wearing dresses more. If you have not watched my what was the Nini title of that video? Something to do with body confidence. I will link it in the description below. Go watch it so that you understand where I'm coming from. But basically, in 2024, I plan on wearing more dresses. Watch out. Keep Watch this space. Watch this space. I, today's video was just me giving you encouragement. You can face your fears. You can face your especially this 2024 and i'm going to do a lot of that a lot of that by the time 2024 in asia december i better be like 75 percent less fearful of anything yeah that's one of my goals for 2024 overcome my fears overcome my body insecurities overcome just basically live intentionally guys i i need to live very very intentionally i need to pl practice wait, 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 wait. i need to practice self-acceptance that is it so anyway guys i don't want to talk a lot i don't want this video to be so long i apologize for the audio if you can hear the echo this room has nothing in it Haina furniture it is an empty room but the lighting is amazing so that's why i came to film here thank you for watching this video um I pray good things for you guys in 2024. I pray that it is going to be your best year yet. And I hope we remain together. 
in this YouTube friendship. Thank you so much. Mwah! Na wapenda sana and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye bye. Oh, you guys! Nilishuka! Ah! So let me... Kai hupa umoni dandraf. Sijapaka mafuta. Mwah!